Charlie. How are you? Good, Kevin. How are you doing? All right. So this is the stuff you guys found, huh? Oh, I love it. What do you think it is? I think it's old growth pine, and uh, the homeowners want a uh, rough side facing the uh, kitchen. Yeah. And I think these boards are going to be perfect. All right. So what are we doing today? I'm going to finish taking the cut nails out. You want to give me a hand? Yeah, sure. You got some old remnants in there. Let me get some tools. Oh yeah, you can see them all throughout, right? You can, just give them a good little whack and then we'll flip them over and pull them out. Probably original cut nails, right? Oh yeah. Well, these old cut nails held this floor down for a long time. Yeah. It's an old one. Well, these boards have a finish on one side, rough on the other. We want to save the rough side and we want to clean up the finish side by taking about a sixteenth off with the thickness planer. We're gonna clean these edges up with the joiner. Let's lay these down uh, rough side up. In particular order, how does that look to you? I think that looks great, what do you think? That looks good to me. All right, we're gonna put these together with a series of floating tenons. Mm -hmm. We're gonna space them about every foot, and then we'll glue them in place and then we'll cut the door to length. All right, I'm gonna mark them. I'm going to put the glue in the mortise because I don't want any glue on the edges. And you want to fall away with the tenons? And let's start tapping them together. Nice and even. That's it. Let's square up one end of the door and then we'll measure it to cut it. All right, let's cut this door to length. You want to mark it six, seven and a half. The last thing we have to do is put these top and bottom rails on. We're going to glue them in place and then uh, fasten them with cut nails again. Is that the side you want up there? Yep. Okay. I want to hold this in place while I tack it. Yep. Just make sure. Okay, it's over there. Hang on one second. Yes, that looks pretty good there. That is looking pretty good, Charlie, huh? Not too bad. Looks good. All we need is some exposed hardware for this door to slide on, and we're all done. Love it. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button. Make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.